Hey, how are you guys doing? How's everybody doing? Good to see you guys. Good to see you guys looking good looking people. <clears throat> so yeah, put down the chat where you're from and what you do. And uh what's your big why? Okay. So we are here to help you every step of the way. In order for us to help you, you got to know your why. So what is your big why? Yep, put down the chat where you are, who you are, where you're from, what's your big why? So that way we can help you go to the next level, whatever it is that for you. Okay. How many here want to make six feet income leveraging somebody else's property without ha having to manage any employees or work more than five hours a week? Okay. That's, I know it sounds too good to be true, but we help hundreds of people just like you all the time doing this. So you can do it as well. Okay. Awesome, awesome. Cool, cool. Welcome, everybody. Welcome to the show. So we're excited today to talk to you about how landlord getting approval. How you get approval from the landlord so that way you can leverage their property. Sometimes their properties um, you know, cost millions of dollars. The good news is you don't have to you know, put that 20% down to buy it and rehab and all of that mess. All you need to do is literally um, show them how, what you do, how you do it, and boom, make it a win-win for them, right? How do you gain landlord approval for subleasing, leveraging OPP, other people property that you don't even own uh, to make you amazing income, right? So that's what we do. And that's what we specialize in. That's how you're able to get to where you want to go fast. Yeah, I'm talking about hybrid speed fast, okay? So, let's see here. All right. Jeanette from San Jose, California. I want to learn more about generating passive income. Fantastic. Cool. Yeah, California is a pretty good market. Um, I have a few students in California doing great. Uh, they can make anywhere from three thousand to all the way seven thousand a month, uh, depending on where you're there at. I'll be charging somebody else probably. Okay, uh, I'm also going live and on other platform here. So, uh, but yeah, good to good to see you guys, and we get started right away here. So today is. The topic is how to master the art of gaining the landlord approval, okay? Because landlord approval is so important uh, for you to leverage somebody else's property. What you want to do is get their approval, right? Uh, and what are the steps, what are the secrets to do that? That will give you the most amount of benefit and also make it a win-win for the uh, landlord as well, okay? So, and then we're going to share with you all our secrets with that. So get ready, buckle in here. Let's make it happen. Super excited about you guys. Yes. Pat yourself in the back, by the way, for being here. You know, it's not easy to do this. And uh, applaud yourself for being here and to do something for you and your family, for your future, right? So, there you go. Master the art of gaining the landlord approval for subleasing. Okay. Learn how to persuade the landlord and scale your rental business. No ownership required. You don't need to ha have a lot of employees. Uh, without any employees, without a lot of headaches, without any evictions as well. In this business, there's no eviction for the last nine years doing this for corporate or insurance clients, especially um, when we're talking about hundreds of 
clients that we have helped to get hundreds of properties, none of them ever had to deal with eviction for corporate clients, right? So that's why it's so, so powerful, this strategy. All right, we got to go over owning versus renting. What's the difference? Why do we do arbitrage instead of uh, buying the property? Because for each property that you buy, you can do about eight or nine arbitrage. So why do you buy when you can arbitrage someone else's property, leverage it, and make amazing income, right? Um, and also, it gives you the flexibility to try to um, test the market out, right? Imagining you having one property and you buy it and then now you find out that it's in the wrong area or the regulations or something happened. It took you like years to save up to buy one. Well, for the same amount of down payment, um, fix it up and all of that, you can rent like eight of them and then re-rent it out you know, um, right away, right? So that's why it's super, super powerful for you guys to understand this. Once you understand this, the skill set, the word is definitely your oyster, okay? Um, anything you want to do will happen. Uh, so that's why it's so, so important for you to understand this. And my team, make sure we are recording this, right? Okay. So short term versus mid term rental. What is the what is the difference, right? Um, the difference with short term and mid term is that short term is just a few days or weekend only, whereas uh, you know mid term you can stay for months at a time. Okay, so that's why it's so so powerful for you to do uh, mid term instead of just short term. And for midterm, they actually, we have corporate clients. We have connection with corporate clients that will pay the big bucks, right? They pay anywhere from uh, double the market rent or sometimes triple the market rent. So it's super, super powerful for you to understand, you know, that this is very, very lucrative and very profitable. But at the same time, you don't have to deal with the short-term rental like the vacationer who's gonna trash your place, uh, smoke alcohol and all that mess, right? You don't have to worry about that because we are dealing with corporate clients who will pay double the market rent and they will take care of the property like it's nobody else's business, okay? So, so that's why it's so, so powerful, okay? All right, let's uh, let's do this business. Okay, and then the other thing is, uh, you know, you got how many have, has vacation rental? You know, you sick in dealing with people who um trash your place or smokes, drink, have parties and all of that. Well, you don't have to worry about that with midterm rental, right? With midterm rental, you are killing it. Um, you know, when you have a well, for example, one of my students I just got it off the phone with has a six month booking from a construction company. And if you know anything about construction, most of the time they will extend. So most likely they will extend. And then he has another house who is booked with insurance housing. So insurance is also would extend as well. And it's, you know, it's very amazing how uh, how people would extend and, you know, that how you can take advantage of, of all of that as well. So remember that corporate clients will stay for three months, six months at a time. Uh, so it's, instead of catching a bunch of small fish, like I, did, I had like 20 something short term rental and it was driving me nuts. It's every weekend imagining having 20 something problem, check in, check out, um, you know, parties, events, pets, whatever, right? So many things happen, so many nightmares. But when I switched over to corporate housing, 
uh, changed my life. Like it's night and day. Uh, you know, I take care of the people, the company, and they come back for more and they stay, they pay, they do good. You know, so it's, it's pretty amazing. Okay. Now, book a free consultation call with us. If you haven't already, we are giving an hour free consultation right now. And for this week, I'm doing a few, uh, giving out a few slots myself. These slots fill up very fast. It is an hour of my time. So take advantage of that. I usually charge like $5,000 an hour. But with this, uh, you know, I want to give back to my community and build on my, our community. So it's, it's take advantage of this, okay? Uh, I definitely don't do this a lot and it's not, it, I can't help, I don't have a bandwidth to do a lot. So make sure you take it seriously. If you book a call, make sure you show up uh, and show out, right? <laughs> but uh, make sure you show up in the fireplace with a laptop, have your spouse, uh, you know, or significant other or um, business partner be ready for you to take notes and also be on the same page. So that way we can help you. And all we ask for is being open, transparent, and coachable. So that way we'll do our best to help you, okay? How many here would like to have an hour free consultation with me personally? Right? Well, here's your chance. Book the call right now, okay? Uh, and, and you'll get it. And, but the slots are filling up very, very quick. Only you have like two or three slots uh, left. So take advantage of it. All right, no landlord will agree to sublease. That is a myth. Why? Because we will take care of the property like it's our own because it's our business. So of course, that's one of the good thing about uh, doing this. And then we will get it professionally clean every few months, right? We pay for it. Any repairs under $200 a month, we get it fixed ourselves. Our clients are higher caliber people, professional to have well-established career and work hard to obtain so they refuse to do anything to jeopardize their job, also families, right? So and all these things are helping the landlord. You see how it's a win-win for them? Uh, I mean, we pay for the maintenance up to $200. We take care of the problem like it's our own. Our clients never had evictions. So the landlord is like, these are like music to their ears for the landlord. So just remember, remember these points when you talk to them, right? Uh, we also, within our community, we have a seven-figure script that we'll go over a lot more detail. These are our clients only that we consult with, uh, that will go over a lot more detail, go over what you need to do beforehand to prepare X, Y, and Z, so that your that when you come on there, 50% of it is just your mental attitude, your tonality, your voice, your confidence. So how do you do that? Uh, if you want to learn more how to get this, then you know book a call with us. All right, HOA, myth, won't work. HOA won't work, uh, won't agree to midterm rental. Sometimes they don't, right? However, a lot of time you can get away with it because most HOA, especially in older neighborhood, they don't really check, okay? Um, but also with midterm rental, it's three months, six months stay. So as long as you don't do any short term, uh, most of the time it's very hard to know. Uh, if you do midterm or long term or whatever, right? So, so that's why I love this business. Now, with that, uh, you know, being said, ideally you want no HOA, of course. You know, you can get a place no HOA is like a thing, and that was easy. Okay, <laughs> I love this button. So there you go. All right, so HOA one agree to midterm rental. Then you just find areas where HOAs are more lenient. So there's no HOA, right? Um, and some HOA allow 30 days or more rental as well, right? And there's a, an abundance of properties. So even the one probably don't work out, whatever, there's an abundance of them. And that's why, you know, you want to have an abundance mindset. If one area don't work, literally the next area next door to it work, right? So uh, you don't have to stay in any one major, one, one city or boundaries. You can expand, okay? I know the method subleasing is illegal or against rental agreements, okay? Put in writing. That is a myth because you can put in writing the sublet clause uh, in the lease agreement 
illegal in the U.S. for decades, of course. So of course it is legal. Okay. Oh, for those uh, you know questions, put in the chat. My team will help to answer it, and at the end, I will uh, definitely answer your questions. So stay with me at the end because it's gonna get better and better to give you the most secrets and also the formula, the blueprints on how you do this as well. All right. Myth subleasing leads to property damage and loss of control. Okay. That is a myth because with corporate clients, we are amazing clients. These are professionals, uh, medical professionals, CVA, IT. We have more insurance than the regular rental because we have triple insurance. We have the renter getting insurance. We have our company insurance. We have the platform that we listed on the insurance on those platform as well. So therefore, we're having triple, sometimes quadruple insurance because um, you think about it, the, the landlord has their own insurance as well. So, you know, you don't want to worry about that because we have insurance paying for a lot of the damages. Now, number three is uh, leases from corporate clients or platform. So we do have control. So yes, we do have control. Um, because you get the leases from the corporate clients or the platform. So, and then we rent out to the corporate clients or the other platform. Uh, we have the lease and then we have the sublet clause and boom, we do have control. Make sense? Now, book a free consultation call with one out of advisor. Then we go from there, okay? It's impossible to find suitable properties for midterm rentals, okay? That's a myth. Abundance of property for rent, new properties daily, will give landlord security and peace of mind, okay? The midterm rental arbitrage is too complex and risky. That's a myth. The midterm rental arbitrage is not too complex. It's not too risky uh, because if you really understand what we do, then you're gonna be, it's, it's gonna be very straightforward. Uh, every step-by-step step we have, of the way, the blueprints, everything you need is there for you, okay? And is it risky? It's actually less, less riskier than buying a property, right? Because one property you buy, you can do five to seven times overcharge. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so it's, it's a lot less riskier. And uh, put all your eggs in one basket when you want to have seven or eight baskets, right? <clears throat> less cost to get started, less loss if it doesn't work out. Uh, complexity when you don't have the proper mentorship, then it is complex. Okay, but when you do have the proper mentorship, it's pretty straightforward. So I already took me ten years to figure all this out and build a community of hundreds of people and help hundreds of people just like you to get six figure income. So why not you? Why not now? Okay. The other myth is corporate clients are difficult to attract and to retain. Are they are they really difficult? Sometimes if you don't know where to get or how to get it, then they are difficult. But if you know the resources that I have accumulated over the last 10 years doing this, uh, and also with my community of over 100 members, then it's not difficult to get corporate clients because within our community, within our network, and we have the secret sources of where you find a corporate client, you just list your property on there and then you make it happen, okay? All right. And, uh, okay, so <clears throat> we have dozens of proven sources and blueprints on what to do, how to say, how to negotiate everything to get the corporate clients. And then corporate clients are actually easier to satisfy than vacationers. Why? Because vacationers are on a vacation so they want everything to be perfect it's a family vacation they have a meet each other so they want everything to be perfect a lot of stress you know uh, and if you know something go wrong they have to fix it right there and day because it's they're on a vacation for two three days right very short they don't have time for messing around but with uh, midterm corporate housing even if you don't able to fix it within the day it's okay because uh, they stay for months at a time, so they give you a lot more lenient, uh, leniency, you know what I'm saying? So it's very important for you to understand that. And that's what I love about corporate housing is you have the lenient uh, to fix properties for, for those midterm rentals, okay? 
Uh, the myth is scaling a rental business without property ownership is impractical, okay? That is a myth because scaling a rental business, uh, it is practical because you can scale five to eight times faster when you buy a property. When you buy a property, you got to pay for down payment, rehab, all that's like, let's say 100K. If with 100K, you can do about eight, uh, you know, midterm rental with furniture, first month rent, all that. And then you can test the market with little risk, okay? Scaling with ownership is actually impractical because it takes you a few years to buy a, save up to buy a property and it takes you like a year to find, buy and rehab a property. So it's just too long. I mean, I, I was doing the math and I bought, well, after I rented out my first property, I was like, this is going to take me, I want 10 houses, 10 properties. It's going to take me like 30, 40 years to have 10 houses, right? With that strategy. But with what we do, you can do 10 houses within months. You see what I'm saying? Within months. Um, and then uh, with what we do, you know, you can get the corporate clients to pay for most of that. So Again, book a free consultation call with us. If you're on uh, watching on social media, you can go on my link in bio while this call lasts. And if you're lucky enough, you're going to get me on the call. And uh, that's your lucky day because I don't do this often. And I charge like $5,000 an hour. But I'm doing this for free right now. For the, for, it's a special thank you for being here. I don't take it lightly at all. You know, I come from a humble beginning uh, immigrant to millionaire. So I really value your time and what you have put into us. And I want to do everything I can in my power to make it worth your while, okay? So with the FAST method, you can start and scale a successful rental business using lease properties only. Or you can also do co-hosting where you manage somebody else's properties and make 20%, right? So with the FAST method, find the right location, ask the sublease, set up to stand now, tap into the corporate clients, right? These are... These are the major things that happen when you are doing this property, right? So find the right location. What is the right location? How do you find it? And uh, the proprietary system that allows you to find the right locations within minutes, okay, minutes, okay? Now that's finding the right location, okay? Uh, our secret is hospitals, hotels, and highways, the three secret edges that will save you and, and help you every day, right? So so that's why you want to be able to know about that. And that is how you find, because these big companies and the government, they already invested hundreds of millions, sometimes billions of dollars, creating the highway system and the resort and all of that. So if they put in that much money, don't you think that they have done their research? Of course they have, right? So that's why it's so, so awesome to know that uh, within minutes, I, I can tell if it's a good location or not. Now, there's three more secret edges that I'm not sharing to the public, only for my paying clients. Uh, and also we analyze the property. How many in here would you like for me to analyze your property, your area, and all of that, right? So that's why I do for my students, uh, you know, you know in, a, in a coaching program. Now, A is to ask to sublease. So you can pitch the landlords on your own. You can leverage our corporate client network of 100 members, 100 properties with a combined 20 years experience. And you can do it as a team, okay? Well, to ask to sublease, you don't have to do it on your own, okay? Now, this is where the power of the network is in the network. So we build the Beyond Corporate Housing Network, right? Um, it has so many members nationwide and when you go on here you will see that you know here click on uh we end we want to edit the slides there to have the partnership okay but if you go on beyond chn.com you click on partnership and then you can see that we are part of a nationwide corporate housing network with hundreds of properties combined with over 100 direct partner and group of coaches you see so all of these, uh, you have members from coast to coast, uh, every major cities we have members in, and this is really like killing it right now uh, by getting you instant credibility by doing this business, right? Right away. And 
you can um, leverage our network. So you have instant variability. Instead of saying, you know, I'm, it's my first or second Airbnb, you can say, I'm actually a part of a nationwide corporate housing network with hundreds of properties combined with hundreds of direct partners and coaches. Wouldn't that be a lot more powerful, right? And saying, oh, it's my first Airbnb, right? Um, so that's why, you know, our students has tremendous results everywhere we go. And, uh, and that's why we are you know, helping a lot of people just like you. Uh, a lot of time have less opportunity than most people, even in, you know, truck driver, single mom, uh, max six feet income. Okay. So tap into the corporate clients. So most people will only list on Airbnb or Verbal. Um, but us, we not do just vacation rental, right? We are doing corporate clients and insurance clients and um, all kinds of creative ways so we can uh, figure it out together right, as a team, right? So, of course, we have the sources that are proven. That's why we can help, you know, teenagers, single mom to actually make money from this. This is very amazing. So this is the corporate housing arbitrage formula that I promise that will change the way you look at things. So the expenses is first month rent, first month deposit, uh, which is about five to seven K, uh, depending on where you are at, maybe 10 K in California is very expensive, but you make more. Um, buy furniture or rent furniture. You can buy the furniture for 79 K. You charge about two times plus the rent or minus, uh, I mean, two times the rent plus or minus utilities, depending on the uh, utilities and depending on the season. So what this means is you make about 200% return. Uh, disclaimer, we are not tax attorney. This is not legal financial advice, but check this out. You put in about 15, 20K, you make about two, 3K a month. After six, six seven months, you make your money back. Within your first year, you double your money, okay? So if you double your money, that's like 200% return, right? So that's why it's so powerful to learn this, this skill set. So if you want like 10, 15K a month, do five properties, you you, you get there. Okay? If you want 10 prop, if you want 20, 30K a month, do 10 properties. You see what I'm saying? So it's so, so powerful for you to, to make it happen. And imagining right now having 10, 15, 20K a month coming in in your sleep, travel. I mean, I just got back from Europe, Cancun, um, you know, Vegas. I just actually, and, and then San Diego travel all the time. And my properties are making me money while I'm traveling, you know, and uh, barely really work maybe an hour or two a week. That's it. So setting it up may take about five, 10 hours a week. Once you set it up, usually a couple hours a week to maintain uh, and make sure that everything is good. And I, I have, you know, a team that take care of most of the work for me. So anyway, imagining you making this amount, what will change in your life? Put down the chat. Okay? I want to know what's your dream, what's your goal, how will it change, really embody it and feel it with your whole body that you are doing it, you are accomplishing it. So that way you are attracted to you instead of you have to chase for it. So write down in the chat, what would you do for you and your family uh, for your loved one where you make this kind of income, right? <laughs> um, the formula for co-hosting, co-hosting is management formula. Uh, basically, co-hosting is you can manage properties for other people. You can do initial, the initial expenses with co-hosting is not much, like pretty much zero. You can either buy the furniture or rent the furniture. Uh, you can charge them two times the rent plus utilities or minus utilities. This will mean like infinite return on investment because your initial investment will be like zero because all you do is charging the landlord uh, or existing Airbnb people that are not doing well at 20% for finding the corporate clients and man managing it. So on average, you earn about 700, 1600 per month per property. So if you want 10K, do five properties, you get 35, about five to 8K. You do 10 properties, you get about seven to 16K, depending on where you live in the country, you know? This is a lot easier than getting a job that will pay you 10K a month, trust me on that. All right, how many here are experienced corporate professional? 
I was a pharmacist. It took me eight years to like went through the hardest thing <laughs> to do study sixty hours a week, uh, and went out, got my MBA as well to be in management. Uh, and I was only making ten k a month after like eight years. Like I mean, of schooling all of that, you know. So with any like corporate job, as you know, you know, engineer or climb the corporate ladder, it will take them at, at least five, 10 years to get to 10K a month, you know? And then it's, it's not like you get it in passive income. It's more like you get there and you got to work your ass off <laughs> for, for to maintain it. And then if you lose, if you do anything wrong, they can, they can fire you at any time, right? That's not the life that I want. You know, I want financial freedom. I want independence. I want to be able to travel the world whenever I want, wherever I want, with whomever I want with. But how do you do co-hosting? And also take care of my family. You know, I tie my mom, my dad, uh, have them with me, you know, get them in a big, nice house, brand new home back then when we first got in there. Um, and then take care of my loved ones the way that they deserve, right? How do you want to take care of your loved ones? Right at that. Okay, how do you do co-hosting? So co-hosting. Uh, how do you do step one is you got to understand the profit. So what you do is you can rent a home for three thousand dollars. You can sublease it for six thousand. You once you find a client to sublease it for six thousand, you can get a twenty percent uh, referral fee, co-hosting fee. So you can make twelve hundred dollars. You can pay for utilities minus utilities vacancy or buffer to vacancy 10%. Total net rent to the owner will be 3,700. You can still extra cash flow to the owner of $700. So most long-term landlord will only make 10% of the traditional rent. They used to make $300. Now they make $1,000 in cash flow. If they make $1,000 in cash flow, that's triple their cash flow, you hear? So triple their cash flow is huge. Uh, in any kind of investment, right? So that's why it's a win-win for them. And it's, it's such an amazing thing that they can do right now, okay? So step two is solve the landlord problem. If the owner manages the properties, the tenants can squat three to 12 months eviction time, time and money, okay? Time and money. Maintenance of properties, toilets, uh, no profit. If the owner management I manage the property, that's what that can happen. If we manage the property, our corporate clients versus mom and pop, okay? A zero eviction for the last nine years with 100 plus properties, community of 100 plus members as well we have, we can double or triple the profit. So that's what happened when we manage, right? Because the uh, corporate clients are a lot better than mom and pop because they have the resources. Whereas tenants can squat in the mom and pop if they lose their job, happens all the time. It's a nightmare for any landlord. Well, we never had an eviction for corporate clients or insurance clients for the last nine years. And that is that is a huge thing to know, right? Uh, with a community of 100 plus members, that, that's incredible. You can either drop, double or even triple the profit versus no profit if the owner managing it, right? Because they had to pay for maintenance, have to pay for auto management. Um, but when we manage, you know, it's a lot better. So how do you pitch the landlord on co-hosting? The pitch is how would you like to double or triple your cash flow while I do all the work? You only need a couple of landlords to achieve your financial freedom and don't ever give up, okay? That's it. Who wouldn't want to double or triple their cash flow while somebody else do all the work. And I just show you the breakdown, the formula for that, okay? Step four, you wanna manage and scale. So you give them monthly reports, ask for referrals, rinse, repeat, and scale. All right, financial freedom formula, arbitrage financial freedom formula. Month one, you do one property at $2,000 a month in profit. Month two, you do, oh, do the uh, two properties now at six thousand dollars a month in profit. Month three, you do two properties now you get ten thousand dollars a month in profit. Month six, 
But if you're doing this by month six, you should have 11 properties, making you $20,000 a month in passive income. That's 264 k a year. Uh, by month 12, if you just do two a month, and I have done it myself, and I also help uh, the people who do this as well. You do two a month, set you free. That's 46 k a month right there. You know, uh, if you do just that, that's over 500 k a year. In 10 years, that's like over $5 million. That's huge. I mean, that's legacy. That's 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 financial freedom, true financial freedom, right? And co-hosting, uh, you make about a thousand dollars a month per property. Um, and by month three, you still have five k a month. By month six, you have eleven k a month. By month twelve, you have twenty three k a month. Both without any risk, really, with with the co-hosting management side. So that's why this is the greatest opportunity I feel like in real estate. Today, in any business opportunity, really, because I study hundreds of different models, uh, you know, and I got my MBA and all that jazz. But what I found is most businesses are very hard for you to make that kind of income uh, and also work only a few hours a week. Whereas this, you can literally work a few hours a week and make amazing income. Okay. So with co-hosting, you can actually um, scale even quicker. If you want to do three properties a month, then that's the number for three properties a month, you know? So it just depends on how fast you want to grow. All right, book a free consultation call on our top advisor. We will take care of you. Um, we're always, uh, you know, good for our word and always take care of the people because we have helped so many people just like you getting success. So we are the oldest coaching community for midterm rental corporate housing out there. Okay, our advisor and our coaches that graduate from the mentorship, we are one of the largest corporate nationwide network in America. And then uh, you see we have we have all kinds of people. So these are the steps. Number one, you gotta get rid of any limiting beliefs and fears that are holding you back. Number two is how you do the fast method so you can start your business. Number three is weekly mentoring to help you focus. Number four is you build and scale your midterm rental corporate housing business. Okay, check this out. I'm officially leaving my pharmacist career, the job next month. Oh I'm God. gonna be drafting resignation letter. Well, I have wow. other other business and Devo as well. Wow. So in addition to that, I'm going to focus on that and then the corporate housing. That is awesome. How much are you making now? Well, on average, $20,000. $20, Last month my, was my biggest month, of course. I grossed up $50,000. Wow. First time. How long did it take you to get there? Nine months now. How long did it take you to get pharmacist? <laughs> Forever. <laughs> I actually got two appointments on Tuesday for two houses. Nice. And I've made a personal goal to at least get eight houses before the end of the year. Yeah. And I'm going to do everything I can to beat that number. That's 20K a month, baby. There you go. We started five months ago. And uh, since then, an average of one every month. I'm at uh, six right now. Just talked to another landlord last night. It looks like we'll probably sign number seven here next week. It's exciting. How much are we making with this? About twelve thousand a month. Twelve thousand a month. Yeah, um, so peaceful, man. Look at this guy. He's <laughs> he's glowing. He got money all over his face, man. I've been doing about one a month, but I think in the next twelve months, I want to do twenty in the next twelve months. Um, I'm sorry. I'm a realtor in San Antonio. Life before was good, but life now is great. I started in uh, mid-May or something like that. Got my property in June. Took about two weeks, furnished it, launched it. Less than 24 hours after that, I got a booking and I've been 100% booked ever since. Let's go. And how much uh, profit are you making on that property per month? I net about 3 k a month on that property. Yeah, you're not really doing much of anything, right? Yeah, I'm no. not doing nothing. The network you provide, man, the tools you provide, people we're around, we teach us so much, so much knowledge, man. I met Dr. Chow at one of the Tony Robbins events, and uh, he told me about this business, so I decided to take action right away. My wife really loved this idea. It took me about a couple of weeks. I got the place fixed up. 
It looked good. The first house, I average about $7,000 profit. profit. A month, by the way. A month. I really like the program. Everything is good. I'm working on my second property. It's just that because I've been doing it for three months. So if I would have had three houses, I probably would have had another 50K or something in my pocket. Yeah, so yeah. yeah, this is make it's good money, easy money. You'll be in some beach somewhere and just, you know, getting paid. So that's cool. I am a student with Dr. Chow's mentorship. We finally got our rentals, our arbitrage. So everything's going good. We got our bookings. And yesterday, we joined the elite. Honestly, with this, we get to know everything Dr. Chow knows. We get to be personal friends with him. It's so much like education because the value, it's way more than what he says. And in my opinion, it's the greatest thing that he's going to do for everyone in this room. Thank you, Dr. Chow. And how old are you? <laughs> I'm 15. Let's go. Awesome, guys. So you see, even a 15 years old can do it. If you're 15 years old, uh, the first lady was a single mom, uh, can make 20, 30K a month, and a truck driver. A truck driver is now making 20, 30K a month. If they can do it, I'm sure you can do it as well. You don't need any uh, major you know, things that you need to do. All you need is just uh, being coachable, uh, being a giver, and also willing to be persistent to reach and get what you want. You know, I want something to get what I want. You know, so that's why it's all about mindset, and you gotta, you just gotta understand that that you are worth it, and that you are able to do it as well. Okay, so let's move to the next slide here. What's our guarantee? Is <clears throat> have you ever like went to college and then what's like you pay so much money and then like what's the point? And then uh you fail uh. uh a a year of college like i was in pharmacy school some people didn't pass that year and they had to pay that again well for us we want you to make at least the coaching investment back with us we want you to make at least 10 times but if not if you don't make your initial coaching back within the first year we will coach you until you get it you know until you get it right right you gotta do it over and over again until you get it right you know so i coach you on how to do that um so you want to learn more about that, book a free consultation call with me, uh, with us, or so one of our top advisor, and we will help you with that, you know? Um, and then let me check out any questions here. Okay, so let's see here. Question. All right, anybody have any questions? Time to put down the chat. Now's your chance. That's right. You can double your profit. Start to all two at the same time. Okay. Let's see. I live in a moment where the management company allowed me to post an Airbnb, but they take 25% of my revenue. What? I can only have 99 a year. I'm not making any money. So I post on Furnish Finder. Okay. For one bedroom, time hard so far. Uh, nobody's interested. Okay, okay, okay. That's a long story. Okay. <laughs> uh, so making a product, I want to charge double. Okay. Rent is um. Okay. Let's see. So my rent is three thousand. Okay. Okay. I want to charge double. Okay. Um, okay, what's your question though? <laughs> uh, if anybody wanna ask this question, like raise your hand too, if you don't wanna put it in the chat and I can bring you up and you can talk with me directly, you know? So. <clears throat> So you're in a place where they can only allow you to rent for 90 nights a day, I mean, 90 nights a year, I wouldn't do it in there. You know, there's so many properties out there that you can do, um, so many opportunities, why limit yourself, you know? Um, that's why, you know, uh, it's very important for you to know exactly how to do it and get the right mentorship and to be able to uh, be coachable. That's why the biggest thing we look for is being coachable, right? When you're coachable, then we can help you. If you're not coachable, then we can help you. So anyway, 
Any uh any last question, guys? Put down the chat. I'd love to help you in any way possible. And make sure that you know you get a free call with us with our, our book call to be able to help you change your life forever, right? Um so our spots are filling up very fast. So you want to book that call right now. Um before it's all fill up, okay? And uh, <clears throat> I also donate a few hours of my time this week. So you're lucky enough, you're going to get me. And make sure you book now before it's all gone. Okay. All right. Any questions out there? <clears throat> yeah. So somebody have uh, a question that, you know, what's really... If you're starting out, what would you do? If you're starting out, you don't have a lot of money, what would you do? I would do co-hosting. Because with co-hosting, you are not putting in any money down, really, right? You, you, you're you just using somebody else's resources. Leverage somebody else, uh, probably OPP, other people probably, and uh, resources as well, you know? So you don't have to put down a lot of money. Um, now, if you are a property owner, you can leverage that, like, you know, get line of equity line credit. Uh, I know people are like, oh, it's, the interest rate is like 8 to 10%, but you're making like 100, 200%. So who care about interest rate at, you know, 8 to 10%, right? So that's why it's very important for you to understand that. Okay, so... Um, and with the with the co-host or always charge, you can scale very, very quickly, you know, very, very quickly. You, you can scale without a lot of risk, right? If you buy a property, there's so many risks. Renovations, everything always take longer. So that's why it's super, super important for you to understand, okay? So uh, with that, things... All right, any other last questions, guys? Sounds good. Well, definitely uh we want to applaud you guys for being on here. And uh you guys are amazing for taking the time to take care of you and your family, okay? So I'll share uh this is you know with the Labor Day that just uh happened. Happy Labor Day to everybody as well. I know Mer America is founded on a lot of hardworking people, but I want to challenge you to work smart now, not just hard. Okay, when you work smart, you can know how to leverage other people's property, other people energy and uh everything else, then you can have the financial freedom as you want, and then live the lifestyle you want. So it's no longer about working hard, it's about working smart. And by working smart is how you can leverage, you know, other people's stuff, okay? And the holy grail to financial freedom is not your job, it's not your business, it's not any piece of asset or property, it is the cash flow that is generated by multiple sources of income. That is the biggest thing for financial freedom, right? So if you don't have it, challenge you to get the financial freedom, uh, the the source, the what do you call it, the monthly as many houses you can, so that way you don't rely on one source of income. When I was a pharmacist, I rely on one source of income, and that was really really risky. And when I started, like even I, I started so many businesses, most of them require so much overhead, so much money that it doesn't make much sense. I put in like 400K to open a restaurant, which failed, you know? I mean, it just costs so much. But with this, when you do co-hosting, it doesn't cost you anything and you're making a lot of money. And then when you do arbitrage, it costs you just a little bit, but you're making way much more. You're making, you know, instead of buying a home, you can do eight arbitrage and make eight times the money, right? So why not? Um, and the last thing I want to leave with you is, why not you? Why not now? Right? Picture that day for you. What is that 
special day for you that that special day that changed your life forever you know for me it's about taking you know a family on, on uh, family vacation so we're able to watch the sunset and you know have special time together um and you know have tears from my parents who you know uh able to see how i'm able to take care of them and able to uh help other families as well to have an amazing time so whatever is important for you imagine that those people those loved ones uh looking at you in a way where you can't be bought by money look at you in a way where they're super proud of you and that you are doing the right thing to help them okay so with that let's bring it in we end with this if you haven't booked a call already, this is your last chance to book the call, so don't miss out. There's only a couple slots left. We help you every step of the way, but we will end with always putting our hands together here. Everybody putting our hands in, and then we're going to count down from 10 to 1, and then we're going to celebrate together, okay? So, oh, yeah, the a link to this meeting, if you sign up, watch your email. My team, make sure you send out the recording uh to the people who register for the class okay because some people said they didn't receive it so make sure that happened nino everybody uh and you will get the recording if you sign up for that okay all right uh you also go on my youtube channel for more some of the old recording in the past or from video dr chow ong c-h-a-u-o-n-g just go just uh, youtube that and then you you got it okay so god bless you guys let's count now together 10 9 Eight, seven, six, six, five, six, five, five four, four, three, 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 two, two one. one. Freedom. 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 I'm celebrating the song. Yay. Happy Labor Day, everybody. Happy Labor Day. Happy Labor Day. Take care and God bless you guys. Peace out.